Hello, everyone. My name is Jacob. Today, we're going to study Smart World 6, Theme 10, Lesson 1. All right, please take out your student books, open your books to page 94. Here, Lesson 1. Today, we're going to study some new words about recycling. Then, we're going to learn some questions and answers using the present simple verb tense. After that, we're going to study pronunciation. Pronunciation of the letter S the letter S at the end of words. Okay, are you ready? Let's start. Let's learn the new words about recycling. First, number one. Here, what are these? They are lights. Everyone, lights. Now you say lights. Okay, good. Number two. What are these? Can you see the picture? These are cans. Again, cans. Say cans. Okay, great. Number three. What's that? This is a faucet. One more. Faucet. Practice saying faucet. Good job. All right, number four. What's this? Do you know? This is an air conditioner. One more. Air conditioner. Air conditioner. All right, the next one. Look at these. What are they? These are fans. Fans. All right, the next word. Are you ready? Can you see this? Do you know what it is? This is garbage. 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 Okay, four more. Next picture. What are those? These are plastic bottles. Plastic bottles. Plastic bottles. The next one. Here. Can you see these? Do you know what they are? They are Shopping bags. Shopping bags. And two more. These. These are newspapers. Newspapers. You say newspapers. And finally, this. What are those? These are some old boxes. Old boxes. All right, can you remember the new words? First, let's review. Number one, old 
Boxes. Two. Newspapers. Three. Shopping bags. Four. Plastic bottles. Five. Garbage. Six. Fans. Seven. Air conditioner. Eight. Faucet. Nine. Cans. And ten. Lights. What are these? Are they lights? Yes or no? No, they aren't. They're old boxes. What are these? Are they newspapers? Yes or no? Yes, they are. They're newspapers. And what are they? Are they air conditioners? No, they aren't. Are they garbage? No, they aren't. Are they fans? Yes, yes they are. Okay, everyone. Do you want to play a game? You do? Good. Look at the picture on the board. What is it? Guess. All right. Number one. What is this? There's cans, garbage, plastic bottles, shopping bags, lights, fans, newspapers, and air conditioners and old boxes. What's this? Is it garbage? No. Here's garbage. Are they shopping bags? No. Here's shopping bags. What's this? Three, two, one. It's faucets. Faucets. Okay, let's play again. Okay, number two. Here, what's this? Three, two, one. Plastic bottles, shopping bags, Lights, old boxes, air conditioner, newspapers, fans, faucet, and finally, cans. What's this? Do you know? Can you guess the word? All right, five, four, three, two, one. It's Garbage! Okay, one more time. Okay, number three. Here. Lights. Old boxes, newspapers, air conditioner, cans, fans, faucet, garbage, and old plastic bottles. What's that? Okay, three, 
two, one. Is it faucet? No. Is it shopping bags? Yes, it's shopping bags. All right, now we finished learning the new words. Do you remember all the new words? Okay, great. Now, let's start the new words questions in the student book. Are you ready? Okay, good. All right, now we're going to finish the questions in the student book on new words A. Look at the table in your student book. It has got four different verbs and phrasal verbs. They are pick up, turn off, recycle, and reuse. I want you to write the new words in the correct table. Can you do it? For example, pick up garbage. We can pick up garbage, but we can't turn off garbage. But an air conditioner, we can turn off. Okay? Reuse, we can reuse plastic bottles. And cans, we can recycle. Some of the words can go in two columns, like cans and newspapers. Plastic bottles can go in three columns. Alright, so write the words in the correct column. Have you finished? Alright, now I will tell you the answers. First, let's do pick up. What are the things we can pick up? First, we can pick up garbage. Second, we can pick up cans. Third, we can pick up plastic bottles. And finally, that's it. Next, turn off. There are four things we can turn off. Number one is air conditioner. Number two is lights. We can turn off lights. Number three is the faucet. We can turn off a faucet. And finally, fan. We can turn off the fan. Alright, the next one is recycle. There are three things we can recycle. They are cans, plastic bottles, and finally, newspapers. Okay, and the last one is reuse. We can reuse plastic bottles, shopping bags, We can reuse newspapers. And finally, we can reuse old boxes. Okay, these are the answers for new words A. Okay, next we're going to study some questions with the present simple. These are yes or no questions. Alright, now it's time to study the useful language.
Today, the useful language is yes or no questions with the present simple verb tense. First, let's learn the structure of yes no questions with present simple. First, we use the words do or does. Do or does to make the question. After, we have a subject. A subject can be subject pronouns such as I, you, he, she, we, they. Some subject pronouns go with do's. Some go with does. So, we usually say do I, do you, do we, and do they. Okay? And does, it goes with he, she, and it. Does he, does she, does it. Okay? So, do or does, then subject, then a present simple verb. For example, reuse, recycle, pick up. Alright? So, here is an example sentence with present simple and it's a question. Do you reuse do, subject, you, verb, reuse. Do you reuse plastic bottles? Okay. Now, it's a yes or no question. So we can answer the question with yes, subject, do, or yes, subject, does. For example, yes, I do. Or, yes, he does. Or, we can answer no. No subject don't, or no subject doesn't. Like, no, I don't, no, she doesn't. Alright? Now, we can use the present simple to talk about Habits and routines. Things we usually do. For example, I recycle old boxes. It means I usually do this. It's normal for me. Now, here are three sentences. I want you to read and look at the questions and say, are they okay or not okay? Okay, number one. Do you pick up garbage? Do you pick up garbage? Is it okay? Yes, it is. This sentence is good. Correct. Two, do he reuse old boxes? Do he reuse old boxes? This is not okay. This sentence is wrong. Because, you see, the subject is he. But, do and he don't go together. We have to say, does, does he, does he is okay. Number three, does I recycle newspapers? Does I recycle newspapers? No, it's incorrect, wrong, because here the subject is I, but with I, 
we don't say does. We say do. Do I? And that is correct. Okay. So now we finish studying about yes or no questions with present simple. Now it's time to study about pronunciation. Okay? All right. Now it's time to study about pronunciation. Today we're going to talk about how to say words that have s or es at the end. In English, lots of plural nouns have s and es. So there are three ways to say the s or es final sound. Let's see number one. Number one, it's the sound s. Okay? You listen and repeat. Practice saying the sound. S, 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 s. Okay? Now look at the word here. This is cans. Can you hear the s? You say the word cans. Cans. The final s makes the sound s. Number two. This is the sound z. z. Sometimes s and es make the sound z. Can you say z? Now let's say the word here. This is lights. Lights. Okay. Can you hear the z? Lights. Lights. Okay. And finally, number three. It's the sound is. Is. Sometimes the letters. E S make the sound is. For example, this word it's boxes. Box is boxes. Now, I want you to practice saying the sounds s, z, is, and practice saying the words cans, lights, and. Boxes. All right. After you finished, we're going to practice speaking. Okay. Now it's time to practice speaking. We're going to practice the questions and the answers, and we're going to use some of the new words. All right. First, I'm going to read the questions and answers. Three, two, one. One. Do you reuse shopping bags? Yes, I do. Two. Does he recycle cans? No, he doesn't. Three. Do they turn off the lights? Yes, they do. Number four. Does she pick up plastic bottles? No, she doesn't. All right. Now I want you to practice reading the questions and answers. You can do it by yourself or with a friend. Okay. Did you finish? Good work. Now, try to make questions with some of the other words. For example, newspapers. Do they recycle newspapers? Yes, they do. All right, that is the end of the lesson today. Thank you for studying with me, and have a great day. See you next time. Bye.